So what are we doing today? <laughs> I guess I should be explaining that because it's gonna be my car. Oh, there was a Jetta on the side of the road. Um, we're going to look at a 2005 uh, Chevy Cobalt SS Supercharged. That's gonna be my new daily, hopefully. Yeah, freight training down the highway. It, it gives a whole new meaning to that. But yeah, we're going to look at this car and hopefully I'll be able to buy it if I can manage to get the cash out somehow. And it'll be my new daily so that I can stop driving my Impreza through the salt. It, the Cobalt's basically the predecessor to the cruise. It, it is the predecessor to the cruise. <laughs> yeah, exactly. it, it really is, because the, the second, really... the facelift model where they added a turbo, you could get them in a sedan. It's basically the same thing as like a first gen cruise. Yeah. The, the OG Ecotech motor. And the which, and which basically means that your cruise is just a Saturn Ion. Because the Ion came first. <laughs> the Saturn Ion is just a couple Actually, maybe that means that your car is also a Saab 9000, because that also had the 2.0 Ecotech in it. I feel like a lot of things could be considered that. I mean, the Pontiac, yeah. uh, what is it, G6? That does not have a turbocharged Ecotech in it, though. Know, they only had the NA1. It's still built off the Cobalt platform. That's true, yeah. It's the same car, just never got a turbo option, which is kind of strange, I Actually, guess. Actually, it's funny. The only difference is, like, the grill. And the taillights. That's it. Yeah. They're basically identical. Oh, and the video quality might be better. Oh yeah, I guess we'll see. I'm using an iPhone now, but I haven't I haven't exactly tested it yet. I guess we'll see. I'm also trying out some new video editors. We're just generally trying to bump the quality up a little bit. Yeah, we read some of your guys' comments and we want to improve on that a little bit. Yeah. I don't think we're experts in video no, editing. No, models. not by any means. We both work full time too, so it's not like we have a whole bunch of time to do this. Tracks. Traffic. Yeah. So we'll get back to you guys when we get there. for a drive in this cobalt. Neato, okay. There's a clutch grab. Oh, oh automatic walking. Yeah, first gear is jerky, that kind of makes sense. Oh. Oh, this is a chair. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it feels like it's just really torquey because it's got a supercharger on it. I feel like a, just that a person. base tune would just improve that completely. Oh, it red rev hangs. That's gonna be not a problem at all. Um, let's 
I'm trying to find a turn. Clutch is good. I think you should give it a full pull. Um, I'm gonna try to. I don't own it yet. Not so. while you're on the turn, so you don't go into the guardrail. I know. I'm but... gonna wait for that guy way over there. Actually, no. Alright. Full blow! <laughs> Red line. Up. Supercharger wine. <laughs> Needs to be louder. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm sold. <laughs> I'm sold for sure. Okay, we're gonna try and that match. This it shifts so good. Now, if only the manual cruise was this good. Yeah. <laughs> oh. I can hear the supercharger just going. <laughs> yeah. yeah, first gear is a little bit jerky. The electric steering, I don't really like, but that's just. That's how does just it how feel? It just feels. Ugh. It's just squishy. squishy. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is early GM electric steering. <laughs> yeah, I'm used to driving with electric steering with the cruise. After feeling that, it's like Ugh. it has it has feeling to it though. Squish. Oh yeah, this is this is amazing. Oh, this is awful. Feel this. Oh, <laughs> it just. There's no play, there's like all the play in it. Watch the loose gauge. It's like my car. Rev hang. That's a math. Yeah. It needs that's why it, math. Yeah, that's why it started so rough too the first time. Definitely just needs the math cleaned. So, I think we're going to try and buy it. Um, we got to see if I'm able to get all the cash out and it'll stop. Oh, uh, imagine having steering wheel controls. I'm not used to that. Reverse lockout. Actually, I do want to. I do want to feel the reverse. So let me. Oh, I was gonna do it. <laughs> it feels good. <laughs> I almost stole it. I know. Okay, yeah, that's good. Rever I just want to make sure reverse is actually there. The e-brake was up the whole time. That has. There's no e-brake. <laughs> what? Don't need that. Auto lights off. Auto lights on. That's the fog light. What in the world is this? Oh. <clears throat> That's the adjuster for the... Huh? Does that even work? I can't tell. <laughs> hmm. Let's see if the fog lights turn on. Oh, can't get out. Someone like ate the freaking switches over here. They ate the paint off of them. Oh man, I love GM doors. Just how big they are. I think he said that you had to hold it. Where is it? It's right here. 
<laughs> I don't know my GM's supercharger. Yeah, like press and hold them. Good. What? They're on. has been blown over before. Get that blown out flex pipe. All the lights are working. That's good. Let me go check for a reverse light. You're good. I like these wheels. Yeah, 18 inch wheels. So I guess, now what? So you said you'd take 2900 for it. If we can get the cash today. But I suspect you'll take 2900 for it anyways. Because make a deposit either way. <laughs> All of the paint is bubbling. But it's what the it's fuck? a cobalt, so what do you expect? Uh, well this part's smooth. <laughs> <laughs> Everywhere else is not. Surprised it doesn't have a rear washer. One of them's working. <laughs> it's just like my impression. Uh. Is it gonna turn off? There it goes. Auto lights too. Neat. It has like a lot of modern features. Look We're at these doors. <laughs> Look at these doors crunch. I have the key in my hand. Don't disappear into the car. Ah! Oh. <laughs> okay. All right, so that's it for now. <laughs> the new daily driver. Here's the new daily driver. We're back in Nashua now. Eric's car started panicking on the way back, having electrical problems. Yeah, I don't know why. So that's not giving me confidence, but we'll hope for the best. But yeah, just getting some gas now. Overall, pretty solid car. I'm happy with it. I just gotta get it registered now.